What's going on guys, it's Pierce from Vapor Alliance Review and we got for you an APO sent from Angel Sigs. So without further ado, let's jump right in. This will be the uh, the copper APO RDA that we're going to be reviewing. Comes in your little black box. Comes with the atomizer itself, as well as a uh, a flathead screwdriver, some O-rings, and what is actually very nice is it comes with other uh, pre-built coils too. Pre-built coils in there. So we're we'll going to build that and uh, and uh, take a vape. All right, so here's the atomizer, a PO. You can see the logo there on the front. Two two air holes on this side, one on the other, and uh, it does open just like that, so you can adjust accordingly. Very nice. Get a pretty good view on the inside from from there. It does not come with a drip tip though, but uh, so we'll be using. Uh, I have one around here somewhere, but anyways, this is it assembled. Very nice. That's a good looking mod. Good looking setup. Gonna take the top off. Nice O-rings. You can tell these are these are tight, so it will be not leaking or anything. But uh, here's the deck. And of course your flathead screws there, which I'm a huge fan of yeah very nice excited about this one okay, pop that top in all right let's go ahead and build this and uh take a vape all right so i got to set up on the ohm reader here because that's the only place i can even use it and uh, we're going to use the coils that it came with two obviously stick these in here Lock that one down. These tools that it come with are so tiny, it's hard to you know what. Much better. Alright. I'll leave that one open. Put the coil in. Alright. Some of these wires out of the way, they're not touching anything. Oh, two zero. Hmm. Let's cut some of these off. Two one, okay. Push these down. Two three. You know what? Let's double check that. I'm gonna put it on the uh, hang it down here. This one's a little bit more accurate. Point three. Well, so there you do. There you go. You're going to get three, three ohms. If you just set up a dual coil with the wires that they send you. So for this one, we're going to just do a single coil setup.
Now that she reads, must reads 0.5. Cool. All right, let's go ahead and get some cotton on here. Just like that. All right, so now we're going to put the juice on here. Test fire. Not bad, not bad. All right, guys, let's go ahead and get into vapor production and a final score. We've got on the um, DNA 30. It's a Hannah Mark clone, but here we go. Wow, there's a lot of flavor in this. Very nice. Wow. I took out a coil. It's only got one coil in it, and uh, you can see that it produces clouds, storm clouds. It, uh, the flavor is dead on. That's really nice. That's really nice. Okay, it's AP, APO RDA. Uh, score, it doesn't come with a drip tip. That's the only downfall. And sometimes not all drip tips fit. Uh, so for that, I'm going to, to deduct two points. Uh, I give it an eight. It's got nice airflow. It actually has uh, your larger ones, and then you turn it over. You got your smaller ones too. So that's cool. Easy to build. Gosh, the the the, the flatheads. Love those. Uh, and it looks nice. So there you go. There you have it. Check out the uh, website. Take it easy.